Welcome back to Festival Fishbowl. Uh, we have Joe and Hillary uh, from the Zephyr Quartet. But you're not really, like, Hillary's from the Zephyr Quartet. Joe is a dance painter. We have to find out more about that. Uh, you're doing a show called Micro Macro. And yes. hi. Hello. Hi. 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 That's all right. The audience sometimes claps, but not for you. That's fine. That's it's not a problem. Uh, no, don't do it now. Oh, whatever. Yeah. Whatever. It turns out there's just a satellite delay on the audience. Yeah. That's all. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, their internet isn't working either. <laughs> either. Uh, <laughs> So uh, tell us about, about what Micro Macro is and how a dance painter and a quartet gets together in holy matrimony. Mm. We weave magic together by creating a show <laughs> called Micro Macro. So the audience comes into the space mm -hmm. and it's a white installation. We're covering the walls, the floor and the tables and the poles of the Wheat Chief Hotel, which if you haven't been to the Wheat Chief Hotel, you should go because it's, I reckon, the best pub in Adelaide. It's an awesome, awesome beer. Yeah, right. what do you reckon? Adelaide That's a good quality in a pub. pub. Mm. Awesome beer. And the best pub. Ah, yes. So anyway, and then Joe, who is an amazing visual artist, mm -hmm. creates this very, very large scale visual art piece. Yeah. While a, a world, a world that, that is created and destructed and then created again so, with charcoal and paint. And, and over the whole white space? That's is right. It? Yeah, yeah. It's big. Wow. It's wow. Very it's large big. scale. And okay. it's it's the history of everything that has ever been and ever will be, ever. And are you One taking show, are you minutes. taking the cues off the music, or do you take the cues off however you just like whatever your hands and stuff just do? We created it together, so it's, okay. it's really it's really intertwined. Yeah, so yeah, yeah. The music and the drawing and the paint work off each other. And all the music is original. Mm -hmm. All the drawing and painting is original. You're not just so putting up photocopies of no. someone else's artwork? <laughs> okay. Am I not doing covers? No projections. <laughs> um, yeah. is, it, is it the same artwork each night? Is, or or is, it, is it unique? Or it's, is it the same? It's unique. It's, there's structure in the work, right. a bit like music. So it's mm -hmm. trying to make art like music and music like art. Right. So there's structure within the work that's then improvised around. So each night great. is... So you have a foundation done. form and then you can mm. move around that. Yeah. Okay, yeah. great. Just like the music has foundation and has improvisation. You know, funnily enough, I see this really good picture and you probably relate to this, Chongy. I, I, I do my stand-up comedy that way. Mm. I improvise yeah. a lot of my comedy on stage. It's not mm. all structured and mm. written and I have exactly the same process, which is quite interesting. It's mm. very yeah. liberating. Yeah, I it think, is. you know, it, it gives makes you it freedom. much more interesting. Yeah, totally. Artists, it's not so. repetitive mm. and yeah. boring and mundane. And we even have some of the audience coming in and doing the drawing, which has right. been very improvised. Yeah, yeah, great. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, that's good. But do you, do you like, as an, as an actual artist, do you just like look at their things and go, no, that's just shit. No. You're useless. <laughs> no, there was a two-year-old yesterday, last night, that did these amazing... Oh, really? Uh, yeah, it's too good. Give me that back. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. I was like, oh, I'll give up. <laughs> Go back to your day job. Yeah, so, yeah. Do you have day jobs? Is that... I or, do. Oh, yeah, boo. I'm a librarian. What are you, a librarian? Mm. Shh. <laughs> just reflex for you, wasn't it? It was just muscle memory. <laughs> I'm in trouble. Go on. Yeah, right. And so, Slash visual artist. do you like go into the meeting room when no one's looking in, just paint up a storm? Draw all yeah, over the walls? Absolutely, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Graffiti in the toilets. Yeah. Mm. Jo was very <laughs> nervous last night because some of her work colleagues yeah. had to come and see the show. Oh, no. She doesn't care about the reviewers or, no. or you know, yeah. the media people. It's funny like, how no, we do that. Work it's funny, isn't coming. it? Library people are very judgmental. Yeah, because yeah, they've got those glasses and they're always looking over the That's top right, of them at you. Yeah. Mm. yeah. And so you, you represent the quartet. Obviously, there's yes. one of you here. Yes. So uh, there are three others, mm. you know, if you do the maths. Hang You'd on. be surprised at how many people go. <laughs> Hang on, so what? How many people are in the quartet? Like, so would you say you were like 25% of the group? Yes. Right. Absolutely. I was in a sax quartet once that had six people in it. That's an orgy. That doesn't really work, does it? It's it didn't really, tet. because there was three of one instrument and we, yeah, it was it was very middle heavy. Anyway, it's not important. Yeah. No, uh, it's interesting though. So, you know. string quartet, right? Yeah, so I play the cello, which is like the big, biggest instrument uh -huh. in the string quartet. They say that's yeah. a bit of a sexual instrument, don't they? Well, it does go between your knees. Mm. And in fact, I was telling a story to my friend. It. Like, I started when I was in year eight and my best friend's mother came up to my mother, who's quite conservative and said, let's hope that's the only thing that gets between her legs. Wow. When I was she didn't 13. want you playing the organ. <laughs> like, oh, yeah. Yeah. It's very appropriate. Yeah. Yeah, so, yeah, yeah. It's very, you're right. That's, that's horrendous. Yeah, that's right. They're not really cool for. And so <laughs> then there's like a viola and a violin. Is that right? Uh, you are so onto it. Viola and two violins. Yeah. Of course. <laughs> yeah, okay, right. Yeah, yeah. Uh, and Minor details. The viola is like a weird instrument. It's not really a violin. It's not a cello. I always thought it was a spelling mistake. <laughs> I did. Yeah. I like, yeah really? Yeah. 
fucked that yeah, up. Some Frenchies yeah. introduced yeah. that. Yeah. yeah. Right. So, but what? So what is it? What? What's the like? They're only like slightly different, right? That's right. Yeah. And you know, the viola cops a lot of those music jokes. Mm. Bad, is there a less of a yeah. string? Is there one less string? No, they all have the same strings and it's all yeah. the same kind of shape. The viola has a lower string. Is it just like a home brand violin? No, it's just a bit <laughs> bigger. So, you know, it's, it's like you know. Alto sax compared to tenor, tenor Nothing sax. wrong with a tenor sax. No. And then tenor just sax you know. compared to baritone. It's just a bit bigger. Yeah. A bit deeper. You lost me a bit. bit lower to sound. Be honest. You know. Okay, so it's like um, <laughs> it's a uh, Kamal. <laughs> right. And then like the guy from the Four Tops. Uh, <laughs> now you're helping. See? Yeah. So okay. there's just different. Yeah. Good. So yeah, they okay. can get different ranges. Yeah, yeah right, right. Thanks. Yeah, it's no a beautiful worries. instrument. Yeah, you're right. Uh, and so, how how now as as a as a an adult musician, like as a as a kid, like when I was in quartets, we'd have to go to the music room at lunchtime and practice. I'm just presuming you have like a life now that you you know you would have things other than just school and stuff. Hopefully, um, <laughs> unless you're a um, moo. So, when do you actually get time to do all that kind of stuff? Well, we, we try and make rehearsals sometimes so that we know what we're doing. Do you do it like a rock band, like in a garage with the door open at night? Kind of, except we go into Belinda's like room in her house and um, yeah, Shut rehearse it up. there. I'd put up some butcher's paper around. and have a crack. Just a bit. <laughs> she, she often brings her sketch. Oh, just a, okay. Right. Small scale. Oh, I small see. Scale. So you, do you know one of the really crap things about this show is that it takes three hours to set up. I'm yeah. Like, wow. So where there's sticking up paper. That's quite big. Of course, hours. I didn't even think that. Because each time it's a new, so yeah. new creation. Yeah. 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 See, I worked that out. That's, That's why I made so. the butcher's oh. paper reference. Yeah, Which is also yeah, exactly. slightly different. Yeah, you're onto it. Yeah, thanks onto very much. It. But we don't want to really do that. No, in rehearsal. Because I got it's it, got a nightmare. So do you guys tour around as a conglomerate? And well, stuff, we or? actually have just been to Perth mm. Fringe. Okay. And What's done Perth the Fringe show like? over there. Well, it's only there's, a, there's only the second new. Fringe, so it's quite yeah, new. Yeah, right? new. It's alright. They're not Very, watching. Oh, Speak freely. Yeah. <laughs> I think Adelaide Fringe is much better. Oh yeah. But it, yeah she it, said it's Adelaide's older. heaps better than Perth. Get, Piss off, Wendy. <laughs> and we're from Adelaide. Yeah. And yeah. Yeah. the funny thing was that we kept on getting all these comments like, "Oh, Perth people are just really overwhelmed with how much is going on." It's but like, they, honey, come to Adelaide. <laughs> there's 900 acts plus a festival. We know you've got your festival of arts, but there's only 100 fringe acts. There's yeah. no excuse. But it's, yeah, but, it's, it's but it is young. And I think Adelaide's so got this culture of, like, we've had this for so long yeah. that we kind of know, oh, well, this is the time when you go out. Yeah. But Perth have like two comedy festivals, is that right? They do. They have a Wild West Wild festival West and a Perth Comedy Fest. Yeah. They've yeah. got a fringe, a festival. So they yeah, I th- and saying it's, that, it's you know, kind of harder to get the word out. And yeah. it's great to do the yes. show. So. Yeah, and then I'll slip over there. Yeah. Bakery is good. Cool, cool. Yeah. Now we have to play a game with you guys. So, uh, what, what's the one that's gonna left? We're going to choose Jenga. Ski-pong. Ah, uh, ski-pong. So th- this requires hand-eye coordination. <gasps> okay. <laughs> oh, we both should be <laughs> No, okay I was going to say, that. like, like okay. Oh, yeah, you'd be good at that. Well, okay. Ski-pong. So you guys uh, would have played beer pong at some point, potentially? No? no? Oh, that's right, you're not guys, um, and you're not American. Okay, so basically how this works is they each have numbers on them, Yeah. Uh, and you have to bounce it on the table and then into the thing. Okay. And then and, and it's kind of like, so it's like, kinda like ski there. ball, because we're not playing with beer. That's why you have Does to Does this call. go for 60 seconds? Uh, no, you're going to get three balls. Just get three balls. So... Can we do some each? Yeah, you can do, yeah, I'll absolutely. Like, you one and a half each. There you go. Uh, you might need to... Can we, we go, stand up? Yeah, I think so. You can get as close to it as you need to. And you're going to gonna move the stuff. Yeah, we'll move. Yeah, we'll move the stuff. Hang on, who's? You're not in charge of me. <laughs> Just making some suggestions. You're like my dad. I've been living with yeah. my dad, and um. Listen, I'd like to come down to your show and do some drawings and play the viola. Uh, yeah, yeah, go on. Don't do people it. judge you? You can do some drawings. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It's free rain after the show. Anyone can go. Rain's rain. always free. Oh, really? Yeah, get in there. Yeah, this charcoal gets blown around everywhere. Yeah. Oh wow. Who's charging yeah. for rain? <laughs> I'll explain to you later. Okay. I'm from right. Queensland. I don't get it. A lot of the stuff. You sometimes you get a lot of it. A lot of it. Sometimes. Mm. Yeah. All right. You should uh, know about rain. Coming you can get. You can get closer if you like. Uh, and I will do some adding. Or you can do some adding. You so some adding? Do you want me to read this yeah, thing about the show? Yeah, and then, Let's have a little. Okay. Go. You can read that, and then you can. Yeah. Add a bit. There we go. No, you can as, as close as you need to be. The Zephyr Quartet, ladies and gentlemen, at the, 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 at the Wheat Chief at the Wheat Chief Hotel, 39 George Street, The Barton. Oh. February 28th, 29th, March 1st and 2nd. It's at 8 o'clock. Okay, that, oh! Oh, that didn't count either. Really hard. You've got to get something in. Oh! See, you're not even trying. <laughs> I think, Jason, you should probably put the cups on the floor, maybe? Cups on the, on the floor? Just, no, that's... Yeah, well, come on. Let's try that. I okay, like that idea. I like, cups cups sometimes, really hard. sometimes directors have good ideas. Sometimes. Okay, you can try them again. Thanks. 
Now you're taking the piss. I swear. You guys would be so drunk right now. Oh, oh God, that was so close. You've used two girls, not a single cup. <laughs> Yay! Four. 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 A grand total of four. This has been our least successful game, just so you know. Bullshit, well, what we about the last. way I played that other game? Yeah. I was terrible. No, as far as, um, yeah, you're right. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> um, all right, so you do the plug again. Thank you very much, the Zephyr Quartet. Thanks for coming in. If you want to go and see the show, it's at the Wheat Sheaf Hotel, uh, 39 George Street in the Barton. Uh, and it's on the 28th, 29th, 1st and 2nd of March. It's at 8 o'clock. Go and check it out. Lovely. Yes, thank thank you. Thanks so much. Go on, Hillary. Leaderboard. I see what's happening here.